This next question is this pandemic has spotlighted the digital divide in San Antonio. How has this issue impacted students in your district? So, you know, we actually had a purchase. We had already had distributed 6,000, 16,000 devices before the spring break. And we still had to purchase 30,000 devices. We have about just over 48,600 children. And so if you do the math, there's no district in the country that I know of that's distributed that, that high percentage of devices. We bought over 3,000 hotspots for internet access. And that was after uh, early before the break, we, we gave out the hot, uh, data plans as well as cell phones at our high schools through a grant where Lanier, we provided 70% to the high school students there. Or, and so just, you know, for me, just show me how deep the digital divide is in our community. And so we're trying to do the best to try to address it. But that's been a big challenge for our children. Yeah, and that's that's the next question. Has it been a challenge getting students to keep contact with their teachers while distance learning is happening? You know, what's, what's been great is that we've seen 88 uh, percent of our students logging on. Uh, what scares me, though, is we have about 2,000 children, and that's significantly lower from, from a few weeks ago, that we haven't been able to get a hold of at all. And so that scares me because those are students that maybe families are becoming homeless as they're losing their jobs, and they're maybe moving out of the community and moving with other family members, and we're just worried about them. So we're still trying to reach out to them.